including this. I'm going to show you two items that are coming up and you're going to see it right down here in front of me. This is stunning. This is brand new. You're the first one to see it and it's for very unique metal dies. And what they do is they're called turn the corner dies. So to get the scoop, you got to stay with me. We're going to tell you and show you how magical these actually are, but it's called turn the corner dies. And again, they are brand new tonight. Now, the other one I want to show you is called our Bountiful Blessings card making kit. Which way am I going for that one? I'm going that way? Okay, very good. This one is huge, and we love it when Anna does any of her big, big card kits. But what I especially love about this one is that it allows you to say stuff easily, and it's really all about sentiments and blessings throughout the entire year. And it's a huge kit. You guys are only seeing this part, but if we can widen out really big, it actually starts on this end. It goes all the way up here, all the way down here, and it ends all the way over here. So it is a massive card kit. In fact, let me tell you right off the bat before it sells out, because most of them do, 24 different uh, cards you can make, and she always packs out the goodies. She always has lots of stuff left over for other things. That's coming up. And again, that one is 100% brand new. This is your first look at it right now tonight. All right, so what are we doing next? Well, we're actually going to go and take another. This is actually going to be a truncated look at a really awesome today special. It's the famous Easy Press from Cricut, and we've got obviously a special configuration designed just for you and just for one single day. So let's look at it. All right, so this is going to be the quick look, and I'm going to go to Anna really quickly. She's joining us from her studio in Atlanta, Georgia. What's the Easy Press? It is the best way to iron on anything. Let's just be really clear about this. It is accurate. It's digital. If you're still using an old, you know, iron from 1954 you know, that you use to iron your clothes, you want to really go into the new age and get the Easy Press. We have two different sizes and two different colors. We have the nine by nine, which is the original size, the one I have, and we got the big guy, the ten by 12. What are you getting? You're getting three of the surfaces. These are great little cosmetic bags. The infusible ink so you can free draw. They are a blast. I love them. Those are included. You're getting the marble uh, infusible papers. Those are included. You also are getting the mat and understand that the big mat that's included is a $50 value by itself and of course you get the machine. We have put together an exclusive configuration. You're choosing which machine, which color, so it's either raspberry or mint. And then of course you can get five flex pays and spread your payments out over five months. And of course, all of that you can get home and we reduce the shipping and handling just for today. I'll show you the value very quickly on the big guy because this by far is the most popular size that we've offered tonight. So here we go, showing you the value. If you just bought the machine itself, which is absolutely brilliant, I just can't do anything without it in terms of my iron-on projects. That's $202. The mat, which is the 20 by 16, is 50. Then 18 for the uh, sheets, uh, 15 for the markers, and then $10 for those cute little cosmetic bags. $295, you're saving $100 simply because you're buying it here at HSN. And nobody else has this offer. So let's go to Atlanta. Anna Griffin's joining me. Hello, welcome back. Thanks, Suzanne. I was just listening to you thinking that there are millions of cricket users at the world. And the top, top two users cut. Okay, Anna, hang on, honey. I'm sorry, we're having trouble with your audio. So I'm just going to show you guys some stuff because I'm very familiar with this product. All right, I want to go right here, guys. I'm going to show the screen. This is one of the greatest things about this is the accuracy that you're seeing right here. You turn it on, you get to do your temperature, and you do a time. And digitally, it's going to heat up to whatever temperature, up to 400 degrees. And with different substrates, you're going to use different temperatures. And they actually have a whole chart that kind of helps you out with it. Then what you do is you're going to go up and down either your temperature or time, you hit this button, and then you walk away and you let it do its thing. The results are amazing. If you're going to do something, let's say you're going to use some of the vinyl sheets, it's something like this. Or if you're going to use, I have my, I have tons of Cricut vinyl iron on, you can create something like this. But what I really love is when you're using, let's say the marble, this all becomes absolutely infused into the fabric. Unlike my vinyl, it doesn't peel up ever. This 
this is actually permanently infused to the fabric that you're putting it on. So if Anna's ready, we're going to go back to her because I know she's got a lot of demos to show us. All right, Anna, let's try it again. Take two. <laughs> I, I hope you can hear me. I, um, I didn't move. But what's so great about Cricut, right? You, you make these personalized cuts out of all these different materials, right? So infusible ink, the brand new material. Iron on. I'm using traditional iron on with my easy press right now to customize a t shirt. And it's counting it down for me. It told me exactly what temperature to put it on and how many seconds to let it heat to evenly apply the transfer. And now I have to let this cool so that I can go back and peel that away. But what's so incredible about tonight, Suzanne, is the fact that the infusible ink pins. The freehand pins where you can draw on your regular copy paper and just a simple little rainbow full of color, you can transfer it straight to one of those infusible ink surfaces that come with this bundle. And so that's as easy as 30 seconds of transfer just freehand. So if you wanted to um, infuse the design into the garment, into the tote bag, into the t-shirt. You can do that with the easy press and it is so simple because this is a machine that's a cross between a traditional heat press and an iron. And it's got a ceramic surface. This is a full nine by nine, one temperature heated surface. It has a digital timer and temperature gauge and this safety insulated base that's coming with the machine. So this protects your work surface. It allows the heat to escape from underneath. And that wonderful little mat that you were talking about this is going to prevent moisture and heat from escaping underneath your transfers onto your work surface. So when you're thinking about creating with your Cricut, when you think about, all right, I need to create a special gift and I want to iron it on and I want it to be incredibly one of a kind. The easy press is the next step in your creative journey. So you create it, the design and you cut it on your Cricut and transfer it to the surface of your choice evenly and it outlasts the actual surface. You can wash these things because the temperature works so perfectly to evenly transfer your design to your surface. Yeah, you get such great results. And think about this too. If you do iron-on printing, which lots of us do, you have the iron-on printing sheets. Um, those work great because you've got to have that great iron source. You need that heat source. I mean, if you go, we're not doing it right now, but if you go to my Facebook page on HSN, you'll see three projects that I threw up there very quickly. I did, I've done visors with it. I've done, you'll see the next one's going to be, oh, this is a tea towel I made for a friend of mine when she moved into her new home. The third one's a tea that I made for myself for 4th of July using my vinyls. And then I've loved the infusible inks because if you hand these to your grandkids or kids and say, hey, make me a, make me a drawing of your family. And then you transfer it onto an apron or a t-shirt or something really fun. Those are just great memories. And all you need is literally just a sheet, a copy paper, just, you know, get paper out of your printer at home. They draw on it with the heat. You're going to infuse it into that surface. Um, I've got some great examples too. I love how vivid the colors are. And you'll find that when you're working with the pins. At first when I did it, Anna, they were a little bit dull looking. I thought, oh, this isn't going to be very bright. But there's something about the markers and then the heat process. And they're so vivid and bright when you do the transfer. I love that. Yeah, I do too, Suzanne. And having the brand new marble infusible ink papers with this bundle, it, it just came out. So we've got the latest greatest on HSN. And just look, it is, it does look a little, I mean, I love muted colors. So this is what it looks like, right? This is one of the four sheets and you're getting beautiful, deep, rich colors in purple and the pink and in the blue, but this is what's so great. All right, wow. so this is the infusible ink framed and this is the exact same pattern ironed on to t-shirt material. Wow. So you, you could tell that what looks like might be muted to start with explodes with color once it's transferred with the easy press too. And just before we go, the, the one thing I have here on my work surface is 
a giant pillow project. And what's so great about having this is that with the 10 by 12, you can actually get this entire surface ironed on um, in one pass. You, do, you don't have to take your nine by nine and move it around. The larger machine is going to, to do this. So if you're actually making multiples of something, you want that larger machine to accomplish this. Well, and also what I love too is you get the, the weight and you get professional results, guys. You know, if you're still using an old regular, you know, iron, um, and we'll show the graphic real quick. Anna, just show them, talk, talk about this real quick, if you will. So that's a really great comparison slide of the easy press on the left and you see that yellow indicates the even heat source. And the right is the iron and that's showing you the cold spots, the differences in temperatures in a traditional iron that you can't get that iron on success with. I mean, yes, you can use an iron to iron on heat transfer vinyl, but it's not gonna be that professional result every time. You're absolutely right. And sometimes you got to go back with the iron and you pick it up and you go, ah, still not enough with this. You put it down, you let it do its thing, you pick it up, let it cool, and boom, you've got a great iron-on finish. All right, guys, so we're going to wrap it up. I love midnight. I love 1 a.m. because I can give you all the options. That's not true later in the day. And if you want the big guy, you should definitely order this one tonight before you go to sleep because it's by far outselling the 9 by 9 Okay, I want to talk about our HSN card. we got more with Anna, including a brand-new item coming up next. Today's the day to pull that card out. Not only do you get four flex pay on everything in our crafting world, but if you use your card shopping for anything at HSN, for every $99 you spend, we're going to give you $20 towards that. And you can do it over and over and over again. So if you use your card and you get our today's special easy press, we're immediately going to give you another $20 off. So it's a perfect day to get that card out and take advantage of it while you can. All right. So let's talk about something that is so beautiful. And this is 100% brand new. And I know our Griffinites, you girls love it when Anna does the new kits and you get busy shopping early. So here we go. This is, we have, oh, here we go. We have fewer than 300. This is going to be a sellout very quickly. It's called the Holiday Open House. It's part of Anna's Finishing School Craft Box. And boy, Anna, it turned out beautiful. Talk a little bit about this in Finishing School. Well, Suzanne, those are easel cards. So you, when you actually um, push up the house and notch it, it's a card that actually sits on so your desk or the mantle of your recipient. And Holiday Open House is the, the um, second to the last shipment in our Finishing School Craft Box series that started in January. This is the box. It is it's designed to be a drawer. And it's a hybrid between our card making kits and our die sets. This is your instruction sheet. It comes with a code that unlocks three videos that are instructional videos inside Finishing School. And Finishing School is our incredible educational library that supports all the products that we've made on HSN. This is the easel die set that comes with the box. And then we get into some very micro teeny tiny wreaths and trees to decorate the house and sentiments to um, make the stoppers for the house. Now, Suzanne, this is actually my house. Um, <gasps> no. it, we designed it. Uh, <laughs> yes, and I, I'll show you. So it looks like this. Um, it's, oh. a, it's a Georgian house. It's 100 years old. Oh, wow. uh, Georgian rev revival house. Uh, and oh, I, love, I love living there. And I made <laughs> an easel card. This will be my Christmas card this year. Um, but just going through the box, <laughs> you get the envelopes and then you're getting the papers that are printed for their brick patterns and then all the house colors and then gold foil um, in, uh, paper as well as um, the face of the house papers. And if your house is gray, we've included it. If your house is beige or painted, we've included it. And what's so great is that instructional video stuff that actually happens and I, I want to show you those um, this is this is uh, this is project three oh, so stop. in your code we teach you look at this uh, look at it up close doesn't that's, it look like a really famous oh, chocolatier that's um, fabulous so, you learn how to do that in your third lesson 
Yes, and oh. so we're making the box to put oh, your Christmas wow. treats in, and so this is included. <laughs> so you get it. You do get all this gold foil paper, but but we had um, a really great uh, Griffinite who got her box, made that box out of red paper that she had in her craft room in the first day that we published the video. And I was astounded. Wow. It was so beautiful. Her name's Yukari and um, she is a master crafts person. But aren't these adorable? Oh, Look, I, there's the I gray love house. Them. And you know what? It's funny. You can do them any color that matches your home or whatever you want to do with it. You can make it, again, you can make it in pinks if you wanted to make it super girly. Here's what happens normally though, kids, is usually she'll do a, 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 a kit like this that'll create a card, but you don't get the dies. You always have to buy the dies separately. So she'll do the card kit and then sell the die kit. What makes this so special is you're getting both of them in this set. And again, you could use all the elements, but guess what? Forever, you're still making the houses out of whatever paper and cardstock you have at home because the dies are now included. Hey, Anna, if I'm already in the auto ship for this, I should not sign up for this, should I? Right, you've already received it. If you were on the auto ship, it has already been delivered to you. And this is our one and only look at this um, because, you know, the it's auto ship was out. so popular that... Uh, <laughs> This is our only our only quantity. <laughs> and it's sold out. I mean, it's basically, we started out with uh, like 900. I went into the presentation with 300 because you girls go online early because I love that. And it's going to be gone. So stay right there. If you're on the line, you got it. If not, just get on really quick before it's gone. By the way, you're going to see um, Anna work with the Empress. This is her electronic uh, die cutting and embossing machine. We've only got about 100 available. It's a beautiful machine. It looks gorgeous even sitting out on your crafting table. It's two twenty nine ninety five, and again tonight we've got four flex pays on all of our crafting goodies. Okay, so now we're moving on. I'll let you know when that one is sold out. You ready for another brand new item? And you guys already again kind of got busy for it. Here we go. This is very interesting. This is called turn the corners dies. And it's something that we've never offered before and we've never seen before. And you actually get four dies in the set. So all right, Anna, take us through what this does. This is so clever. <laughs> So, Suzanne, we sell lots of Dresden die cuts uh, on HSN that are made in, in Germany, and they make beautiful, intricate, little bitty die cuts. Well, it, it occurred to me during quarantine that Turn the Corner was the appropriate name for this die set because, just look up close, the, the beautiful corners that the, this die set's going to make. It's going to, you can actually cut on your large Empress plates uh, all of the dies and cut 16 corners in one pass. And what's, I'm just showing you some really pretty things just to inspire you, but what's so unique about this is that they look like they're medallions, but they're designed to actually cut apart like a little Dresden die cut. Huh. So you're going to, I actually have them in pink so that you can see that a little better. So you just snip them just like you would the Dresden sheets and snip off the, the part that holds them together. And I think this is called a chad. And you are just snipping it off. And now you actually have, it, it looks like a medallion, but it's actually four corners. And That's as beautiful. you're working with them, it's so adorable. Horrible because look at all of them together for, um, well, for some reason they're not all on that one. Okay, <laughs> but you get the idea, right. right? So this one is very lyrical and looks like calligraphy. And this one, I love this just by itself, but you cut it apart into the little four pieces and you end up, like I said, with 16 corners, you're getting four in each pass. And right. so they just go, they come apart just like that and however you want to, just snip the middle. It's got a fleur-de-lis at the top of it, so you could use just the two. <laughs> you know, you could use two, or you can just cut them all, all completely apart and have four. So I would recommend using your Xyron adhesive with these because you do need, just look at the, what you, if you start with your oh, Christmas wow. cards, adding the beautiful corner gives you a whole different um, take on, on <laughs> Halloween, on, on Christmas. So 
this is what I like to call our, you know, we do a lot of flourishes and dyes like this that I think are the little black dress of your craft cabinet because you'll use them for just about every single project uh, that you can imagine. So oh, wow. there again, that beautiful medallion used all together, but then you could go back to this one and see how they work all cut yeah, apart. And I and love turned. it because it just turned around, oh. like flipped over. Yeah, yeah. And, and guys, you're getting yeah. all four. You're not choosing. You actually get all four and remember, once you cut them up, they're going to actually create, what, four, four times four, right? So you're going to get all these little pieces. But also, I'll be honest with you, I think using them just as they are is really quite beautiful. <laughs> Yes, yes, and I think that what that happened, Suzanne, with our, our crafts team, we got a lot of samples in where they were just the medallions, and I thought, okay, well, they're no longer turn the corner. Um, but I think there's something that's very useful when you're thinking about adding to your collection, because as crafters, we have a lot of stuff. And one of the things that I think is you wanna find usefulness in what you purchase. And so having, there's that lyrical corner that I showed you that I just think that that's so pretty, and it's like, it's like I, I like to call it fancy punctuation. It gives you decoration in a way that um, most of our die sets are really big, and we go through our big machine. So this is the, we've got the little Empress Mini out um, to show you how much fun these are to cut. Okay, guys, let me give you a quick update. We have now sold 400 sets here at the wee early 1.20 a.m. on the East Coast. And again, this is another one of those brand new kits. If you've never seen Anna here on the air, you'll see her new kits. They sell out really, really quickly. It's just because they're innovative and they're fun and they're interesting and they work beautifully. And they will take anything that's kind of plain and boring and make it truly beautiful. And that's kind of what Anna's whole world is about, you know, bringing beauty mm -hmm. into our lives. But it doesn't have to be complicated. We we also do have the mini available. So if you want to get the mini, this is the little version of the big guy I just talked about. And we'll try to pop some information up for you. We also have a couple tools we'll get to in just a second, just as a couple of extra things that go back to this. If you want those metallics that she's working with, we have a whole kit of just metallic cardstock that's available. So here it is right there. It's beautiful and it's really, really beautiful just gorgeous fine quality and it's um, double-sided. So you've got color through and through. So those are available as well. But getting back to this before it's totally sold out, I just want to look down really quickly too. You get the instructions sheet. Are we getting the magnetic sheet to go with it, Anna? You are, it comes with that, it, give, it comes nice. with instructions. And the Empress Mini comes with its own dies as well. And just look, I just ran this through really quickly with that double-sided foil. And you, 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 you're gonna need a tool-in-one because of the intricacy of these dies to get that to release. But just look, when you cut them apart, how cute they become. They're like, they're, they're just like fancy little doily edge makers easy to use, a lot of pretty detail that can be added in a quick pass through your Impress or your Impress Mini. Um, and then there again, masculine design, um, Halloween, Christmas, you name it, this is an appropriate for all occasions. Yeah, so it's so, so clever. And again, you know, it's, it always is amazing to me. You can take basic paper or basic cardstock and just a couple of these gorgeous dies from Anna. And it just is so wow, it's so powerful. And it'll totally change the whole texture of a card or even a scrapbook page that you might be making. Please stay right there for these. Go to .com. I'm telling you, it's the quickest way. It's a couple clicks and you'll get your order in before they are sold out. All right, so she talked about the tool and this is it and it's brilliant when you work with a lot of Anna's dies or a lot of dies in general they've got a lot of little pieces and parts to them and this is called the tool in one you've got your pokey tool on the end this little scrubber is brilliant because it allows you to get rid of all those little empty spaces so you run it over the die and it pops them all out easily so you do get that beautiful finished look this is a it's called again the tool in one it's $24.95 and tonight we've got four flex bays and it does a couple more things too because it's pretty cool just wanted to feature that one other thing this is our holiday uh cardstock and it's all these beautiful foil colors what you're getting with this one is officially standby where is it oh here it is 100 pieces they are five by seven five colors 20 each in silver red light blue gold and green and those are 1995 and we actually brought these back in and i love it too because they're double-sided so they're color through and through which is just gorgeous okay yep. so we're done with that miss anna wait. oh text it's, weight uh, yes 
it's it's Tex, and that's because we didn't want it to be the heavyweight cardstock because we wanted to make double-sided bows for Christmas. Of course you did. <laughs> yes. So when the, when the back is just as important as the front, you have to have double-sided text Girl, weight. That is so, so of course, of course. Love it. Oh, look at the embossing. Wow, that's impressive. Yeah. And all done with this. Okay, when we come back, we have something really special and it's it is truly special. It's about saying the right thing but not having to think of it. And of course, Anna has done that for us. Stay with us. I have journeyed around the globe. I've seen the beauty the world has to offer. Now I'm bringing you new fabrics, patterns, and soft silhouettes with spicy details. Exotic, but with a new degree of sophistication. Global Chic is all about fashion freedom. So be free. Iman Global Chic, only on HSN. It is a big craft event all day long. Hi, I'm Suzanne Runyon. I will be coming back, and I love my own show, I guess, because it's got my name on it. But anyway, um, it's called Suzanne Gets Crafty, and it's from 7 to 9 p.m. East Coast time. We always save brand new items. It's a big variety show. I kind of give you some um, sort of background look at, at my love of crafting and hobbies and kind of, you know, my history in it a little bit. And we have a lot of fun. So we've got some special kits coming up. So please rejoin me 7 to 9 p.m. tonight, and we'll have a really great couple hours together. Right now, Anna Griff is with me. She joins us from Atlanta, Georgia. Her studio in Atlanta, and we have another amazing kit, and this one is brand new. So you guys are getting your very first look, and I love it. It starts on this end of the table, and it goes all the way down to this end of the table, and of course you get a beautiful box to keep it all organized. Wow, this is awesome. So Anna, why did you decide to create Bountiful Blessings? <laughs> well, it, when we're making birthday cards and we're making them in the fall of the year, so we're pushing the season. This is a this is for the birthdays in September and October and November because we've included bountiful imagery like pumpkins and um, dahlias and darker colors. There's fruit involved in what you're looking at is this card kit actually creates 24 cards where our normal card kits, they create 20. And there are over 265 pieces for you to create birthday cards easily. So half of them can be made with a collage card topper like you're showing, and half of them can be done with our dies um, to accentuate uh, because you're getting lots of papers and embellishments to go with it. So just look at the box. I, I'm gonna show you because I love the fact that not only are you getting the instructions and um, everything that you need, inside this is a traditional card kit format for us. It's a 3D card made with four, four different steps. And just look at the, when I say bountiful and blessings, it is sage green, it's beautiful floral, there's um, acorn, Pretty. and oak leaves and gorgeous um, grape leaves. So there is, there are flowers, but they're all fall in color. And then when we get to the, like the most important part is a collage card topper that you can make a card in minutes. And then there are gold foil embellishments. And then if you want to personalize your birthday card and, and you don't want it to say what the card topper says, you can overlay it with a sticker. You're getting the envelopes, you're getting foam adhesive, you're getting bows, and you're getting flowers that match back Back to the front of the collage card topper and that's what I mean by showing you here so this this design was actually in the card topper and you see right there and we just went back over it with the 3d sticker to make it a dimensional card and so that's something that happens 
pre pretty quickly. So let me just show you. I'm going to start with one card, really beautiful old world design. And this gold foil uh, die cut comes inside. Now I've made a collage of all those pretty elements to put on the front. There's a birthday cake. There's dimensional flowers. And then it says birthday wishes. But maybe I want to say have a lovely birthday and that way now you have a personalized card that says what you want it to because we gave you those stickers it's such a beautiful card kit and i know that people love our card kits because of their ease of use they, they can go in your desk drawer and you can make a card in minutes and not have to worry about finding all of your tools or all of the pieces because everything is in the box. And it's just up to you how you combine the elements. And it's a collage experience instead of a, a time waster, you know, or anything that would take too much time. And let me just show you one more. We're going to take the the pretty gold foil stickers. This is the card topper. It's already um, die cut and foil stamped. And usually that can go down the center of the card. And we just wanna go back with the 3D stickers and a little, um, a little ribbon to make this just as beautiful as it can be. And all in those fall colors. So we're we're not talking our you know our regular birthday box. This was designed to be a standalone item. 24 cards that you're going to be able to make in gorgeous, beautiful blues, coral, orange, and even when you sh you showed a pumpkin a second ago, we included the pumpkin and the butterflies so that you can extend the life of this card kit through the winter months and make a seasonally appropriate birthday card. Oh, it's beautiful. And here's the thing you have to understand is Anna makes all these kits here exclusively for you. You cannot find that. I love Anna. Anna, you guys, I love Griffinites and they're all like, oh, I'm sure I can go to the store and find it. No, all of these kits are 100% exclusive. You can only get them here at HSN. You'll never get a better value. You'll never get more bang for your buck than you do with you when you buy an Anna card kit. It's because she gives you so many, you, you'll get done with all your cards and go, oh my gosh, there's so many pieces left. That's what I love. She loves abundance. She really feels like she wants to give you more than you're gonna need. And so you can make these really voluptuous cards. And the neat thing about it is you'll make it really fast because it's really brilliant how she puts it all together so you don't have to be really great at this but the person who receives it will think you're brilliant and they will not be able to throw these cards away i mean come on you can go to the, you go to the store and buy a five dollar lame printed card that has nothing interesting happening or you can make this yourself with all this dimensionality and all this beauty just because you have the kit and again you don't have to be really good anna does and her team they think through it all so that we look like we're really good, but you certainly don't have to be. And Anna, I love, you know, you've taken a lot of steps away by adding that collage topper to start with. I did, and I make it, I, we, we reverse engineer it. We give you all the perfect elements for you to create the things that you enjoy looking at on the face of the card. And so it's at your fingertips in the box. They're, they're, it's going to make 24 beautiful cards. You do um, you get the envelopes and foam adhesive to make everything even more dimensional than it is. But you know, the, the zinnias and things that, dahlias that you get at, in the fall um, and mums, the, those things are included in the set. So it's a really beautiful card kit. Okay, so really quick, this is pretty funny because I know we have to wrap it up, guys. But here, I grabbed a card, this is how simple it is. I grabbed a card, all I do is I'm looking around going, I don't know, there's some really cool pieces. So I'm gonna grab this, I'm gonna put it right smack in the center, I'm gonna grab this, I'm gonna run it down the middle of it, and then I'm gonna grab some embellishments. Let me get a little rose over here. This little dusty pretty rose and look I mean come on I'm done wait I gotta put a ribbon because you gotta add the ribbon look at that okay boom okay Look, I did that in literally 15 seconds. That is how brilliant her cards are, and people will love getting them. They feel very special when you get an Anna card. In fact, Anna was so cute, she made me a card. My 15th anniversary was yesterday, and Anna was kind enough to come on to the show, and she made me the most beautiful card. Now, I know how Anna made this. She used it with one of her kits, right? <laughs> so I know, it, you know, it, but I'm like, oh my gosh, even though I'm so familiar with her kits and I love them, I think this card is precious. It's gonna go on my desk. I'm never going to throw it away. 
And I know it probably came out of a kit very similar to this. So people get such a great reaction when you give them a beautiful card like this. So Anna, thank you. And I especially love, she made me um, two um, like tumblers with my monogram using the Cricut machine and vinyl. And I love those, it has my monogram on it. All right, so we're gonna keep moving because we have more goodies to show you. These are really, really fun. And at first glance, you go, I, I mean, I think the name is correct, but it's not correct. It's called the Halloween Cut and Emboss Folder Sets. So you're getting all three of these and they emboss and they cut at the same time. This one does scream Halloween. It looks, hey, that looks very much like a uh, you know, spider web with bats. But when I look at these other two, Anna, for me, I, would, I could even use these two on the card kit we just finished talking about. <laughs> you could. They're, well, we called it Spell Burst that starburst cut and embossed folder. And then we called it spooky brocade because for me, I like to use patterns all season long for all holidays. But just look at what a cut and emboss folder, oh. it's gonna create a layer wow. in, in just one pass. Oh my. And you see how we've cut and embossed the glitter paper that's coming up later today on HSN from us. That's the great. spooky bro brocade is beautiful inked and, and part of a, a, a Halloween collage. And it just becomes a, a, a beautiful pattern in which you can craft on top of. So these all cut those beautiful layers in one pass through the machine. And what we're going to see is that come out of the folder. So the die is embedded into each of the folders. You're not choosing, you're getting all three. And what we're gonna do is, I didn't even really cut uh, or measure the piece of paper because the folder's gonna do it for us. And I'm gonna run this through my little Impress Mini to get a, a spooky layer um, <laughs> right out of the box. And it's so much fun because this is it's you you feel like you're doing something but the but the die and the folder are doing really all the work for you and you're going to right get this great little layer like i said i didn't have to measure and now it's i'm gonna let's just make this card because uh you would add a little adhesive maybe you have other die cuts that you love to use but then the layer goes right in the center to create a focal point for your card. And then we have lots and lots of embellishments and amazing Halloween things coming up today, um, later on today, so that you can create oh, exactly that card. <laughs> and here's something you have to understand, I think this is really important, is when, this is called a one and dunner, um, because this is a Halloween themed item. She'll never bring it back, she doesn't repeat it. And we have a very limited quantity going into the day, because obviously it's a very niche, kind of holiday. So if you want to pick this up, it'll not be back. I mean, you'll see her do lots of different designs, but this is the only opportunity to be able to get these. And as she mentioned, you get all three. And I think it's so brilliant because a lot of times you'll have to run through and do a die, then you get an embossing folder out and you have to run that through or vice versa. It's so brilliant how you do both at the same pass. Right, it's a real time saver. You get a decorative element in one pass. It becomes the, the jumping off point for the rest of your card. And you, what you're looking at is something in just such beautiful taste. Like the, the Halloween, you know, in traditional orange and black, but that little layer, because I didn't have to change my plate system, I didn't have to get out other things. I am able to create that focal point that create, look at this, create it's a spooky card, a chilling, wonderful card <laughs> in awesome. one single pass. That so is cool. I'm going to, I'll make some more just for fun because, you know, I think that uh, we, we love looking at building these, these projects. All right. So a little black um, foil, but then the pearl, our pearl metallic paper right there in the middle. Oh, and maybe great. we need her. Look, she's from our witchy paper, witchy, witchy card kit. Yep. And this is so fun. It says best witches. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Maybe she, maybe there's a little spider and a little rose, but that's so fun 
because in composition, as, as a designer, I really like elements that give you a visual resting place. And with each one of these cards that I'm showing you, it, it's doing exactly that. So that's a single pass through the machine. You're getting that. This is glitter paper also cut and embossed through that with that one little pattern. And there we go. There's the spider web that you like so much with the spider in it. Well, and again, I'll go back to it. Like, for example, when you see this one, which is kind of like a starburst, right? I'm going to show everybody this one, Anna. For me, it screams uh, snowflake and it screams holiday and it screams New Year's Eve and it screams celebration, almost like confetti popping. Does that make sense? So while the theme is Halloween on this, I could see using this one for a ton of different ideas. And the same is true with this one. I want you to see how pretty this design is. Again, this could be on a wedding invitation. I mean, it'd be beautiful. It could be on a sympathy card, a thank you card. So other than our super spooky spider web with the bats, and I'm sure a lot of you will come up with really cute ideas that are not Halloween for this one. But I think other than that, the other two are wildly versatile. Certainly they really do amp up a Halloween card. But again, you buy this now and you'll find you're reaching for it for other different ideas. It could be scrapping, it could be card making, it could be a different sympathy card. It could be many, many things, especially with these two guys, because I think those are generic enough. I mean, they're exquisite, but they're generic enough to use for a lot of different um, kind of th um, themes, really, when you think about it. So Suzanne, we have a whole Starburst theme going on today, and you're going to see Dresden embellishments with the with that Starburst. You're going to see oh. um, you're going to see celestial dyes with the Starburst, and so much fun. We had such a great time creating with that design element. That no matter how you put these things together, like I said, this is like this is your foundation piece for creating a card. It's the important center that illuminates your your sentiment wow. it's the place that you design around it's the in in that single pass through the machine right you're not having to align a die and go back and emboss a, a pattern and like we used to you know mm -hmm. it's just i love that the dies are embedded in the folder because then we get there's that starburst adorable um i've got one more to show you just hang with <laughs> That's me. That's great. There it is. I oh. love it. So That's so gothy. It's Starburst. so gothy and fabulous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, and again, I've got a couple. There's the Starburst showing up again here. Look, just change out the patterns, change out the paper, uh, and use the exact... Oh, look, I love that one. Oh, that's got a technique on it there. I mean, think about this. I mean, you can do so much with it. Uh, and again, you get all three. You're not picking which one. All three for $29.95. I think 500 are sold, uh, have been sold now. So again, if you go to hsn.com, that is the way to be able to grab that uh, again, before it's uh, sold out. And I will tell you, as the day proceeds, a lot of you, we love our Griffinites, but a lot of you go online early on and you order a lot of our popular items. So we get to the show and we don't have a lot left. So if you do see something like that and you go, oh my gosh, that's just the coolest idea, then ordering it tonight's smart because the chances of seeing it later on today are pretty slim because so many people order ahead of time. Okay, so Anna, we're going to continue on. This one is the famous teacup pop-up dies. And this is so clever so you look at this card and you say oh that is so cute i love it it's so pretty and then when you open it up oh, look at the magic literally a teacup pops up in the center of this now anna i remember when we first launched this and everybody kind of went absolutely crazy this is one of those rare occasions which we actually reordered this and brought it back in for our big event today so this is as clever as can be Thank you, thank you. Well, I, I started out in architecture and design school and making three-dimensional interactive cards like this is part of, just part of my DNA. And I love, love, love engineering things to work perfectly, to be a surprise when you open the card, giving you all the elements and the know-how uh, to create things that, you know, go beyond your, um, your imagination. And this die set is definitely that. So this is the teacup itself, and this is the saucer. This is the structure that holds it together. 
um, this is also the structure and then you have the handle of the teacup. And if you're looking at it and going, I could never make that, we walk you through step-by-step step with the instruction sheet on where to put the adhesive, how to cut the pieces, how to assemble it all, and how to fill the teacup with the things that you love and adore. But this is the engineering, right? So you see this flat piece is actually going into the seam of the card, oh, and it's going to so open cool. perfectly once hey, it's all Anna, assembled. Hey, Anna, I got to do two things. Sorry, I got to interrupt you, because two things. One is I got an update. We, remember I told you that if you watch the show and you love something, you want to get it when you see it with Anna, because it sells out. Well, that really cute house design that we had in the very beginning of the show is completely gone. Anna, you know what I thought? By making these, can you imagine using these as your placeholder for a bridal shower, for the Thanksgiving table? How cool would that be if you just use them as is and then just put their name right here inside it? Absolutely. We have um, we have shown some amazing things with these teacups. Where they they have been filled with kitty cats and paper <laughs> dolls and all kinds of things. And you just you want to use the paper that you have at home or our teacup cardstock that's coming up um, to you fill this little section right here with your die cuts. And so a lot of the cards that we have are 360 degree cards because when you open them, this one's not, but you when, once you start adding all these great things inside that cup, you're like, wow, I want to do it all the way around. And so it becomes this uh, beautiful experience oh, wow. of embellishment. That's gorgeous. So, <laughs> yeah, and combining the dyes and things, embellishment dyes that you have from us, like our fern dyes or our butterflies or even our fancy edge dyes to create the card, you're going to end up with a, a really extraordinary look mm. with each one of these. So uh, imagine being somebody that's at home, maybe they're recovering from something and you want to send a get well card. This is the way to do it. Oh, wow. And it is, uh, it is, it's guaranteed to bring a smile to your face and to, to the person that you've sent it to, because it's like, wow, I didn't know you could make that. And you get all the credit, which is a lot, a lot of fun for me. Well, so. here's what's interesting right. too. We've actually done a teacup kits. So she's basically done all the work for you. And then when you used it all up, it was gone. So everybody wants to get their hand on actually the dyes. This is the big deal because you just change up your color patterns. You could use, you know, Buffalo stripe. If you're a Buffalo check, if you wanted to, I don't, you know, whatever. You don't have to stick with just the typical, you know, Anna colors, which are beautiful, but think about, you know, purples and pinks and matching the baby shower, the bridal shower, whatever it might be, maybe it's the invitation, but it's the fact you're getting the dyes. That means forever and ever, you can make as many fabulous little teacups as you want. And Anna, I just, I can imagine the ideas that your Griffinites have come up with just to use for this dye. I mean, there, it would be so yeah. cool for so many different reasons. Well, my birthday was last week and oh, I birthday. got... Thank you. Same to you, belated birthday, Suzanne. Thank you. Um, you're, you're on my calendar. Uh, you, you and I share share the same two week span there. Um, so so I got the teacups and and my friend Gail sent me a teacup full of flowers and it was so full it no longer popped up. It was just the teacup full of stuff and <laughs> it, it it's so exciting to see how people put their own spin on this die set because look there's the cat in the teacup and it's just, you know this could be so a puppy cute. dog it can be hearts it oh, can be cute flowers. Oh, Valentine's Day. Yeah, it, it, any any type of celebration oh. where you want to like add a little ruffle. This one's 360, oh. so that no matter which way you open it, it it's a gift in itself. And I think that's what's really fun about being able to have this. Um, it's definitely been the year of the pop-up for us and we have made all kinds of things pop up we have a um we ha this this came back by by popular demand mm -hmm. and uh we want to make sure that everybody can get it so uh just look one right after the other one more beautiful than the next 
and it's all about the way that you decorate it. So clever. And, and again, take the stuff that Anna's already made, use your own color sources. This is what you want though, you wanna get the dye. Because after you have this and the instructions, again, this could be anything. For example, I mean, this is what it looks like even if you don't put it in a card, okay? So let's say you just did a really solid piece of cardstock to keep it flat. Think of all the things that you could put in here. Like I said, how awesome for a Thanksgiving, uh, at the Thanksgiving table, these are place cards and they're in front of everybody at the Thanksgiving table, the baby shower, the bridal shower. You can, I mean, whatever you can stick in there. Can you imagine if you put little tea bags in there and you set them out when you're having friends over and maybe it was a gift that they take with them when they leave. So for me, Anna, just being able to have the cup is worth getting it because of all the different cool things you could do. Like a back to school gift for a teacher, you could put a gift card inside here and hand her the whole thing just like this. You know what I mean? <laughs> I do, and I think that's a wonderful thought because it becomes a vessel. Instead of a yes. card, it's a, it's a way of decorating and giving a paper gift. Yes, exactly right. Oh my gosh, you're just, you guys are gonna go crazy with this. All right, so it's back in stock finally. It's called a reorder, we don't do them often. And again, she's done pop-up tea cards, but once you were done with the card kit, you had nothing left. Now you can make them unlimited as long as you want in any color or format you'd like because she's got the dyes that actually create it. All right, so here's the item number. We've got the large plates that are available that work back to it, because you can see with the large plates, I can do everything in one single pass. So if you want the large plates, they're $59.95. The large place plates, excuse me, work on the original Empress die cutting and embossing machine, which is also in stock. Then I gotta talk about the cardstock because it's beautiful. These are 48 pieces of 12 by 12 cardstock that are precious, Anna. Just beautiful colors, <laughs> great prints. You did a gorgeous job with this cardstock. It's double-sided, Suzanne, and yep. it was designed with the teacup in mind. That that very first pattern is uh, antique Meissen florals, and Meissen is a very famous porcelain maker. And just look at what happens when you scrapbook this paper. So oh, it, wow. it, you can your teacups can become a three-dimensional work of art for the wall. <laughs> and having the 12 by 12 papers with all those flowers, you end up with just an extraordinary bouquet of papers that coordinate. That's Isn't great. that something? Oh, it's a beautiful so set. It's absolutely stunning. All right, we got more to talk about because we're not done yet. We got another 10 minutes before I'm gonna say goodbye to Anna for now, but she's gonna be back throughout the day. So we got a lot of surprises. This one is another one of those kind of stories like the teacup. Anything that pops up we know is magical. Right? It's just, there's something that brings a smile to your face. So this kit is about creating pop-up poinsettias. Now, by the way, this was, this interesting fact, this, in fact, I'll show it to you right on this card. Um, interesting fact, this was my mom and dad's wedding flower, and then I chose it for my wedding flower as well. So look how pretty that is. Now, this is a full card making kit. So remember when I talked about the teacups, and I said, oh, when you were done with the kit, you know, you want the dyes to be able to make them. The original kit is what you're seeing here, is actually building the full card, not just making the center element. Now this sold out when we first launched it. It is back tonight. We've got four flex pays on it. You're saving a couple bucks off the retail price, which is lovely, and you'll be able to make 20 full cards when you're finished with this kit. Uh, obviously, Anna, the poinsettia is very near and dear to my heart. I love that that was your wedding flower. Uh, my parents got married at Christmas uh, as well. And it was always, uh, their anniversary was on Boxing Day. And so I, I love that, that you share that. So when you look at this three-dimensional card and you see where you can make, there, there are embellishments in the kit for you to make the front of the card and the inside of the card. And the 3D elements for this are already bagged by color. So we have the traditional colors of poinsettias in the kit. So we have the red, we have the variegated, we have ivory, we have the pink. And then we have all these beautiful engravings and gold foil embellishments to further embellish the cards. But this is what it's actually going to make. And what happens is that you'll see on the back that this one, this one is, um, is, has been folded tightly. But these little tabs 
fold in and secure in the bottom and you do that of the flower and you do that three times and you secure it in a way that allows the card the, to maneuver, all right? So it opens and you write your messages on the signature cards that come in the box. You get these large sentiments. These were designed for the outside of the card, but you can use them on the inside as well. And they make complete sentences. So when you're looking at that kit, Suzanne, it's in our, our traditional gift box and it's gonna make 20 beautiful cards. And we have, um, it does come with an idea sheet that walks you through step-by-step step how to make this card. So you're getting foil embellishments and sentiments that go horizontally and vertically. These are stickers. And I love these because you can never have too much of these and these are big and they're not teeny tiny, which is kind of fun. But the signature cards are small, so you don't have to think up a lot to write and then all those greenery all the greeneries in, involved and then little tags to put inside the flower for your dear friends and there are those beautiful poinsettias all bagged step by step then then the card surfaces yes there's a pink one for Christmas envelopes and foam adhesive and like I said that idea sheet is included yeah. So when we're making one of these cards, we're going to start with a card base. And that's what um, th this is. This would be, you would add this die cut, but then these things are included. And when it says center, glue the flower center here, that's what's really important. And so as we're working with this, you're going to fit the little tabs into the slots and glue them with a nice heavy duty adhesive. And then you put it on the sides of the, the back of, a, of the poinsettia. And if you open it flat and secure it to the inside, then the card will open like it needs to. And then you would just decorate this, right? So there are lots and lots of pretty, pretty um, Christmas foliage and um, sentiments to add in. And it's really just, again, about composition. So once you've actually created your um, centerpiece for the pop-up poinsettia, the first one, once you've gotten the hang of it, it will become a kit that you will go, wow, I can't wait to make these and send them this Christmas. You know what? And there's nothing like the surprise of opening up your card and having that wow. It's like the teacup. You don't expect it. Like, you, you know, you get a pretty card. You go, oh, this is so pretty. Wow. What did she send me? And then when you pop it open, look at the magic that happens. I mean, that's a moment of joy, right? And I think we could use more joy and more beauty in our lives right now, for sure. So what a great, great surprise. That whole pop-up experience. But you know what, Anna? There's something about it that's almost hard to describe. Is it, is it like the feeling of opening up a present and seeing something beautiful or like opening up a treasure chest and, and seeing all the beautiful, you know, rubies and diamonds and emeralds inside it? Is that, is that the psychology of it almost? <laughs> it is. Well, I like to, I like to say that um, our cards and card kits are like receiving a gift mm -hmm. and not only a gift of, of paper, but a gift of thought and a gift of your time and a gift of your creativity. And we just make it simple for people to do that. And we do it, we do it every day. And where if, if this looks overwhelming or complicated, we've made it simple for you to add these rings of petals and create your own sentiment and tell someone that you're thinking of them this holiday season. And this will be the kind of card that people that people cherish. And even looking at this, I was just pinching the middle of it because there's some little actual stamens inside this one. And it's been inked with, um, with green and gold to give it an antique effect. So if you're someone that's an advanced crafter, this kit is going to go a long way in giving you the elements that you need to create your own expression of this kit. So don't let it be, oh, I'm someone that doesn't do kits. This is just the jumping off point for those of you that really, really love to make it your own. The other thing I noticed that's great is that it also is a little more generic. You know, a lot of times maybe you have to, you want to give it a gift to a card to somebody and, you know, do they necessarily 
follow the Christian tradition of Christmas, of course the poinsettia is related to Christmas. But what I like is this one says warmest wishes to you this season. So again, it can be a little, can, you can get, who doesn't love flowers? Okay, so let's just start with that. But I love the fact that you're kind of sensitive to that, Anna. You know, you don't kind of, it just doesn't scream Christmas if you want to give a, a card for another reason. You give us the sentiments to actually work through all that. Yes, it's, I've been a stationer for my entire career. So, mm -hmm. so 26 years I've done fine stationery and it's really important to acknowledge all of the ways that we celebrate yes. and that the, it is, it, this one does say together is a wonderful place to be. Merry Christmas. Yeah, so if, if it's Hanukkah, Chanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever it is, there are sentiments that are appropriate for those occasions. I love that. Well, Anna, I'm going to say goodbye to you now. Thank you, darling. We'll see you later today. Yes, All yes. Right. I'll be back in the, a little later this morning. All right. And hang out. I'll see you at 7 to 9 p.m. tonight with Suzanne Gets Crafty. Thanks for joining us. Last year, QVC and HSN searched across America for the best and the brightest. These people and products were a big hit. Now here's your chance to be a part of something even bigger. Are you our next great discovery? We're searching for the big find. Show us what you've got, America. Applications open now. Search the big find on qvc.com and hsn.com for details. August is HSN's anniversary month, and we have plenty of milestones to celebrate. I love you. Yay! <laughs> we'll be recognizing some of your favorite brands, including Chef Wolfgang Puck, Professor Amos, and Smashbox Cosmetics. Plus, Jay King has a few surprises. This is my absolute favorite event. The Beekman Boys bring their friends, and we'll relive fun moments celebrating Suzanne Runyon's 15th anniversary. You're going to be a part of it. Tune in all throughout August to celebrate HSN's anniversary month on HSN and at hsn.com.